Hello there, how are you doing? I haven't done a video in a very long time, so I thought I'd do one for you today. I'll do an eye, a drawing. Um, a drawing a little bit to do with what's going on in the world at the moment. Um, obviously, the world seems to have gone a little bit bloody crazy. Um, so I thought I would try and do something to go close to how my feelings are at the moment with this world and um, and its leaders, if you call them leaders. Um, I'm sure probably some of you would think that, but um, I don't think most of the world do. So um, I'm going to try and do a little drawing for you. Again, it's going to be an ink. And, um, of course, of course it's an ink. What else would it be in? What well, ink's the kind of, um, liquid of the gods, in my opinion. Um, so, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do a little drawing. It's just telling you how I'm feeling at the moment. Um, there's a lot of. I don't know, war, hatred, everything else going on at the moment and it seems to be the, the people seem to be suffering and the, these bullshit leaders that we have seem to be uh, doing quite well out of it. Um, I'm not a political person, never really been a political person, always quite hated politics. But, um, you know, sometimes you got to pick up the pen and say something and, well, this will be uh, my, <laughs> my speech. Um, don't you worry about all my splashes and blots and mess. That's just part of what I do. If you haven't seen my videos before, I'm Kieran Siemens, and um, I put lots of videos up on Facebook and YouTube and other such internet places for people to enjoy. And um, pop over if you if you haven't seen any of my videos before. Um, pop over and have a look and see some of my other videos and there's hundreds of them up on places like uh, YouTube I've got a channel up on YouTube um, go and check them out you might find a few you like um, I don't usually do political stuff um, as I said I kind of usually avoid all this political BS, the, the people that like this color and the people that vote for that color, I usually avoid all that. Um, so go and have a look. I'm curious to know what everybody else is thinking about what's happening in this world. Have you done any of your own artwork for it? I'd love to see it. Um, today I'm gonna draw my interpretation of these world leaders as some kind of paper bag over their head with some kind of face painted onto it, you know? Full of, full of fraud and fake and corruption and other bullshit things. I'm quite fucking sick to death of it. Um, you know, I'm hoping that one day in this world we'll we'll have world leaders that actually care about people. That will actually be doing good for people. 
Uh, I know that all the bills of gas and electricity and everything have just gone through the fucking roof. And, um, yeah, I'm very sick of it already. So this is my world leader. Um, as always, um, whatever your political status or thought or feeling or persuasion, whatever you want to call it, give me your thoughts on what I'm doing, what I'm, you know, do you kind of see this as a, as a valid point? how these leaders are, or do you think I'm being unkind? <laughs> oh man, I'd love to hear that. Go on, tell me. Um, so this is a, a little doodle of thoughts. Let's give him a long, manky old fingernail, why not? You know, makes you think sometimes when 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 something like a war seems to be brewing or a war is taking place and how little people want to stop it and it makes you think of all the money that they must be making from these wars you know they must be you know how can, how, I, I, you know, I, I just don't understand stuff like how can all these political people, all these world leaders, these politicians have money investments into bullets and tanks and other such deadly parts of the world. You know, all this, it's just disgusting, you know. So, this is my thought of a world leader. He's got a paper bag over his head. We don't see who the real leader is. Of course we don't. We just see that big smiling face full of bullshit promises. So, you know, the promises that we've had over the last couple of months leading to years of of course there won't be more bills. Of course there won't be higher energy. Of course there won't be this, this, this. If you vote for me, I will be the good guy. What a lot of shine, really. Sorry for my language, but... Um, See what you think anyway. He's reading a he's reading a magazine at this point. Of course. What is he reading? He's reading War Crimes Weekly. I'm using Indian ink here. My my love for Indian ink goes on for the last few years and I absolutely love it. I love that feeling of putting it down and <laughs> there's no change and there's no corrections. That's what you've got. Let's give him a nice kind of nipple tassel. Why not? I like that idea. And that kind of uh, perverted twist to the character was nice. <clears throat> Thinking about a tattoo for his chest. What kind of tattoo could he have on his chest? Hmm. 
we'll see. Let's put in these gnarly fingers and these long fingernails. Like I said, I'm not a political person. I'm just a regular old artist, um, you know. So don't take this drawing in this way or that way or this this belief or this following or whatever. It's just a general sweep. Um, what would artists know about? politics and stuff like that, you know. We're just little lonely artists, aren't we? I've been uh, drawing for quite a few years now. I started out, if you don't know, I started out in animation. Many, many, many years of animation. Um, I loved animation. I absolutely loved it. But there comes a time in everybody's life when you, you need to move across. Let's put a few hairs on his butt. What about a tattoo on his butt? Right. Love. I love money. Of course he loves money. All his decisions in life for come from his decisions of money and who he's going to be paid for by who. Yeah, it's quite a sad life for some of these people, really, isn't it? There he is. And I'm going to have him sitting on the toilet. Let's have a big money tattoo. That would be nice, wouldn't it? It looks like a Superman, but it, it's it's actually um, a dollar sign. I think that's what a dollar sign looks like. I'm not really. Uh, no, again, no political side or whatever. It just happens to be a. The dollar sign is more of a kind of regular more general money symbol than anything else but you can in your mind you can kind of convert that over to a, a euro or a pound or whatever in your mind of however you see it there's his trousers down around his pants. Are you an artist? I'd love to know if you are. You know, there's some amazing artists out there these days. Absolute incredible artists. I met a lot of very, very good artists in my in my life. And you might be one of them. If we've met before, or send me a message. Tell me what you think of what is going on. Tell me what you think of what. Again, this is just a symbol of words on a page. It's not any language. So don't get upset by my squiggles looking like French, German, Spanish. 
Chinese, whatever, it doesn't look like anything. Um, it is just squiggles. There he is. Sitting his fat ass on the toilet, having a good old crap while he's reading his War Crimes Weekly. Let's put up a pipe on the back of that toilet. I love to draw. Drawing is really my life at the moment. I just spend most of my time drawing. It's just, it's become a life addiction, I think. So what's your love? I love how ink can just find its own level on the paper. I just love it. Put some rolls of toilet paper up there since this guy is obviously completely full of shit. He's going to need a few extra rolls. Hey, what do you think? <laughs> I'm not quite sure why he's completely naked in this picture. <laughs> I don't think many people sit on the toilet completely naked, but he's kind of like this kind of, I like this kind of perverted idea for this world leader. As with his, uh, his nipple tassels and his strange tattoos. This is my world leader. Well, there we are. I don't know. Hope you can see that. Um, at my world leader. Screwing up the world, getting some ideas from his magazine about what to do next with us, with all of us. Thank you very much for watching. Let's put a, let's put a lovely signature down there somewhere for you. You, you know who's to blame. <laughs> Oh dear, I shouldn't say that, should I? My name is Kieran Siemens, and um, I hope you enjoyed my drawing. Like I said, if you do, pop over to uh, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, all of those crazy places, and um, give me a like, give me a follow. Um, I put up a lot of drawings, very recent, uh, a lot of regular drawings. And um, come and tell me what you think of what I'm doing. I would love to hear from you. Love to hear what you think. World leader. There we are. I hope you enjoyed today's drawing. And um, thank you very much. 
for watching and being there and for the support. Talk to you soon. Come back again.